Hello everybody, we're back here on the Hunter Call of the Wild with a uh, quick last second video that I uh, had to make the uh, morning that I'm uploading it. Oh no. Okay, this could end poorly. Well, that's quite the start to the day. Well, as I was going to say, today we are going to do a little bit of a uh, lion hunt. As recently, a lot of people have been wanting to see a lion great one in the Hunter Call of the Wild. So I figured why not start up a lion grind here on the main account instead of on our beginner account like we have been doing and uh, see if we can get ourselves some good lions. And of course, we start the day off with literally the smallest lion I think I've ever killed. What a way to start the day. But like I said, recently I've seen a lot of people requesting a lion great one here in the Hunter Call of the Wild. With the addition of the moose and stuff like that, a lot of people have looked at the current great ones in the game and thought to themselves, Rohonga Savannah is the only map that doesn't have a great one now. So naturally, it would make sense that they would try to put one on here. And so naturally, I've seen a lot of people talking about what they would like to see on Rohonga Savannah if they did end up getting a great one on this map very soon. And a lot of people have agreed that Lion would be one of the best options as well as Cape Buffalo. But today we're going to be talking about the Lion. I do actually think a Lion Great One would be pretty cool. It would be the uh, second Predator Great One in the game. And it would also have probably one of the more interesting looks to it. I, I definitely think they could do something cool with a Lion Great One. Let's get that guy before he gets away. But I do think they could do some cool stuff with a Lion Great One. They could definitely go for some type of a scarred up look if they would like to. And we're actually going to take a look at some images as we talk about it to kind of give uh, examples of what I'm talking about. But I definitely think a lion with some scars on its face or possibly missing a eye would really make for a good great one. But obviously it couldn't just be that. That would not be special enough. So I think they should also make it to where it's a very large lion, like a super bulky lion if possible. And then also give it some type of unique characteristic, like a darker mane. Like maybe a mane that is almost completely black would be really cool for a great one. And obviously, as with uh, most of the great ones in the game, you really can't just have one variation. So obviously, they would have to do a different variation as well. And to be honest, I think a great variation would be a fabled leucistic lion because leucistic lions actually are a thing, but we currently don't have them in the game. And to be honest, they look pretty incredible. And as always, this uh, lake is absolutely loaded with lions. This has always been one of my favorite lakes to uh, hunt the lions. And uh, real quickly, I will show off where it's located. It's right here. Uh, no clue how to pronounce that, but it's to the left of the starting outpost. And this area is just incredible. It's such a good place to hunt lions. And again, I'm going to go ahead and uh, show the picture of the leucistic lion because... I really do think this would be one of the coolest variations they could do for a Great One Lion. I just absolutely love the look of the leucistic and I think to give it a fabled fur as a Great One Lion would honestly be a really good move on Expansive World's part. I think it would be a very popular Great One to hunt if they did end up ever adding it. And honestly, with the massive uptick in people wanting a lion great one recently, I couldn't imagine them not eventually doing it. The question is, what variations would they give it? Would they do something like the fabled leucistic? Or would they just give it kind of like a darker mane like I mentioned earlier? Would they make it super scarred up? Or would they do something completely different? Let me know down in the comments what you guys think. Let me know if you think they will do one of these variations or if you think they're just going to create something new that none of us even thought of. And also, if you're new to the channel and you're not already subscribed and you're still watching the video at this point, be sure to hit that subscribe button as I do post daily content with uh, tips and tricks and stuff to help you become a better player as well as doing lots of highlight videos and just fun videos like this where we kind of talk about the future of the game and what we would like to see. And as YouTube is my full-time job right now, you might as well subscribe if you're enjoying the content and watching multiple videos anyway. That way we can continue doing what we do here with the consistency that you guys come to expect with uh, seven videos a week and five to seven live streams. But that right there is our best lion of the day at 47.09. And I think it's about time that we take down this last lion and then move to the next lake. Get lined up on him and that should be a good hit right there. I do hear another one as well. 
Yeah, right there. And we got a vital hit. That was actually a clutch shot. I cannot believe we actually managed to get that. And another mythical. That is crazy. So I think I forgot to mention what the goal of this grind is even going to be. The goal of this grind is going to be to try and get a blonde male lion as well as a bigger uh, dark brown male lion. So hopefully we can end up getting one of those. And I think one of the crazy things about if they do a lion great one is the fact that it actually would not be that terrible to hunt for. We look at stuff like the black bear and it's one of the toughest grinds in the entire game because the bears are always like three hours late to their zones and they're very inconsistent and move uh, lakes quite often. With the lions, from my experience, they're actually pretty consistent. I can just hunt this lake right here over and over again and they're pretty much always on time and they're always respawning here. So I think it would be a much more fun grind than the bear grind would be. And there is that little level six line that we took on the run. Not gonna lie, kinda surprised that we even clipped vitals, but you know, can't complain. That was actually a decent shot. And the final lion of the lake is this little level seven right here. And honestly, that was so many lions at one lake. This is why I do actually think this would be a very fun great one grind if they ever add a great one lion. And I think if enough of us are asking for it, it eventually will happen. So, oh, as always, be sure to make your voice heard if you want the great one lion in the game. The developers listen to it whenever we have a lot of people saying that we want the same thing. So if you want to see a lion great one, let them know on their social media, let them know in their discord. And the more people that want it, the more chances it will get added to the game. It is insane just how quickly the respawns got here. Look at that. I just claimed that male lion. And I look down range and we've already got four more female lions over there. That is crazy. Uh, one of them's not very visible anymore, but we do have at least four of them there. Five. This is nuts. Well, let's uh, try to get some of them down. Oh my gosh, what am I watch? What am I looking at? That is insanity. Okay, this is exactly what I'm talking about. I, I I think this would actually be an amazing grind. Not to mention just a fun grind, even without it having a great one. Just hunting for lions in general is a lot of fun because they do stuff like this. You get a lot of them at one lake and the respawns arrive super quickly. Unfortunately, a couple of those shots were not great, so... Gonna have to uh, drop a couple more in them. Something else that does make the lions uh, kind of an easy animal to grind is the fact that all of the predators in the game for the most part, or at least the cat predators, do kind of bug out whenever you shoot them and they kind of just stand in one place until you get within 150 meters of them. The mountain lions do it as well, but with the lions it's uh, very, very noticeable as they are much larger and definitely are one of those uh, species that you don't see a ton of typically at a lot of locations except for this one right here obviously but yeah they do have that weird bug where whenever you shoot them from far away they kind of just dance back and forth and then stop and give you another shot so that would make it a pretty easy grind there's another one somewhere i hear another one i i could have swore that we killed all of them but it, it seems like another one has showed up, and unfortunately we got a floater there as well. Now let's go claim these real quickly. Let's uh, see if there's anything special in this group that is just a regular tan. Uh, we're just looking to see if we can find any of the uh, dark brown or the blonde. So far it's not looking like it. These are all just normal lions and should be at least one or two more that we took down. So, uh... This, this thing ran a ridiculous distance away from where we shot it, as you can see. So, yeah, we're probably going to go ahead and end this video here, but let me know down in the comments if you would be interested in seeing a lion great one in the Hunter Call of the Wild, and if you would be interested in seeing it, let me know what you think you would like it to look like down in the comments as well. But with that being said, thank you all for being here, and as always, if you haven't already, be sure to like the video, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace!